So, Chag Sameach, Chag Sameach, it's Shavuos. And interesting, even though the Torah makes zero, zero mention of Shavuos being the day of God giving us the Torah, um, it's all in the sages. The sages do the calculations in Tractic Shabbos in the uh, pages 88 and up. Um, but interesting enough, that's what it became for us, Man Matan Torah Tenu. And we celebrate, and every child knows Man Matan Torah Tenu even before they know about uh, Chag Bikurim. So um, let's talk about the Ten Commandments. In the Ten Commandments, we have over there, I am God, your God, who took you out of Egypt. And I keep on going over and over with that. Why? Why is it not I am God, your God, who created heaven and earth? And um, I'm going to share with you, yeah, there's teachings on it, and I've shared it in the past. I want to just share with you where I am right now. You know that, and probably especially for children who go through divorce, parents, very often the thought comes up that um, I didn't ask you to bring me here. I was doing quite well by being up there or not being at all. And you parents brought me down here and now look what you're doing to my life and blah, 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 blah. And I think about that in relationship to what God is saying. I am God who created heaven and earth. I created you. And very often we're going to be stuck in the question of the first Rashi. Who asked you to? Who needed you to? And that's why I think ultimately God is telling us what makes me your personal God, what makes me your intimate God, is not what I did 5,784 years ago. And it's not even what I did 57 years ago when you were born. It's what I'm doing with you right now, right here, today. Today, day in and day out, each and every one of us have to face our Pharaoh. And very often, our Pharaoh feels far stronger and more powerful and louder and more provocative and more dominant than our Moses. And God tells you, I am God, you God, who tells you, Bo El Paro, come with me to your Pharaoh, face him, look him in the eye, because day after day, I am here to take you out of Egypt as long as you're willing to hold my hand and leave the past painful familiar and walk with me into the unfamiliar redemption. People, may we finally tell God yes. May we finally hear his hand, hear his voice, hold his hand and say, God, you are my God who is taking me out of Egypt right now Let's do this.